Install His Grace Exam Maker. You can download link through the description below. Open His Grace Exam Maker. We need to create a new exam project. Click on the file tab. Click new. A new exam project file is created. Now, we add a subject first. Below, we'll give the subject a name. English. We are leaving the default score to be 1, and shuffle questions to be false. Now, we add questions. Click add question on the question tab. We presently have three types of questions. We'll use the three to see their difference. We pick the first one. Multiple choice single answer. This type of question allows you to have many answer options, where the examinee can only pick a single answer. Now, let's add a question. We add each answer options. To select the right answer, click the radio button next to the answer. Let's click preview and see how it is. Click OK. Our question has successfully been added. Let's add another question. Let's add an instruction for this question. We add the question and the answer options. Let's add an explanation to the answer. This is usually shown after the examinee must have concluded the examination. Let's add the topic of the question. Now, let's try another type of question. Multiple choice multiple answer. This type of question allows you to have many answer options where the examinee can pick more than one answer. We add the question. You can add more answer options by click the plus icon button. We tick answers by checking the checkbox of the correct answer. This question type has an extra property of partial marking. That is, the examinee get marks for each of the correct. For example, the score obtainable for this question is 1. The question having two answers means that each answer carries 0.5 mark. If the examinee checks one correct answer and checks another wrong answer, the examinee gets 0.5. Whereas, if the partial marking is not checked, the examinee will fail the question once wrong answer is picked. Now, let's check out the third type of question. This type of question allows you to give the examinee two option to type correct answers. We also have extra property of case sensitive. That is, if checked, the examinee will fail the examination when a small letter is used instead of capital letter, and vice versa. To add an essay or comprehension passage, click the passage tab. Click add new passage. Now let's add the questions for the passage. We select the passage to be used for this question. Let's click preview to see how it goes.
Now let's add another subject. We name it, General Paper. Now we want to add an image to the question. Click the editor button beside the question box. Click picture and select the image. Let's see the preview. Let's add another question. This time we will like to add images into the answer options. We click on the editor button next to the answer option. You can resize the image. Let's see the preview. Oh, we have not saved our project file. Let's save it. It's important to keep saving from time to time so as to avoid loss of work due to unexpected computer anomalies. Now let's continue. This time, we want to add an image created from another application. We go for Microsoft Word. We draw a circle. Copy the circle by pressing Ctrl C or click the copy icon. We go back to Exam Maker and press Paste or Ctrl V. Now we have it. Let's add another subject. We name it, Mathematics. Let's copy this to Exam Maker.
You can build and copy your equations from Microsoft Word and paste them into Exam Maker. To edit your question, click the Edit Question button. Now, let's see the overall preview of our questions. Click Review tab and Preview. We have each subject's arranged at the top. While questions numbers are arranged on the side left. Let's check the statistics of our questions. We have 15 questions still good to go, that is, the questions that has a content and answers. You can click details to know the questions involved. Now, let's add the examinees. That is, the persons to take the examination. We add their details. You can as well import the examinees from Microsoft Excel or our School Results Manager application. Let's assign the subjects to the examinees. For now, we select all subjects for all examinees. Let's add the examinee usernames and password. We are using their first name and admission number. Now let's publish the examination. We set the duration and other settings. You can add general instructions for the exam. Then select the subjects to deploy. Let's save our project again. Now, click Publish as Exam Module button. It is now published successfully. Now, we are done with creating examination questions with His Grace Exam Maker. Please, check our next video on how to use the exam module file in conducting an examination.